Hence the maxim made famous by JFK, John Fitzgerald Kennedy, that leadership and learning are indispensable to each other. Leadership and learning, indispensable to each other. So institutions of higher education, like this one, therefore, have a critical role to play in producing and shaping leaders and informing the actions of leadership, not least in the delivery of evidence-based policy. Evidence-based policy. For the scale of the problems our world faces at this time and the complexity of their nature, the multifaceted nature of effective action required to address them demands a response that is based not on rhetoric alone, not on bland assurances or blind or bigoted assertions, but on evidence, science, expertise, and the product of tried and tested experience. The tried and tested experience that is reflected in so many of the lives of the distinguished personages in this room. And yet, you know, we live in a world and at a time in which there is a crisis of confidence, a crisis of confidence, a deficit of trust in all of our institutions, a world in which conspiracy theories abound just go, go onto the internet, look at the product uh, of your WhatsApps. Conspiracy theories everywhere. A world in which conspiracy theories abound and in which all too often demagoguery, demagoguery is preferred to reasoned debate. And there are plenty of demagogues, are there not, in our world? Demagoguery, preferable to reasoned debate. So UPSA, this institution, the institution in which uh, this august hall is located, is to be congratulated for carrying the torch of academic excellence and for professionalism in service delivery. It has never been more important than at this time for us to stand up for those values, to stand up for them and to invest in them. Mm -hmm.